Why is your thyroid so important? Well, in case you didn't know this, the thyroid gland governs 100% of the activity your cells have in your body. Every single tissue, cell, and organ is influenced by thyroid activity. Now, how can your thyroid not be important? How can we know if the thyroid is having troubles functioning? And can we feel or see the symptoms in our body? Sure we can. So in today's video, I'll reveal six symptoms that indicate your thyroid is needing help and how to fix it before this precious gland ends up affecting your entire body. Hey guys, Dr. Gus here, naturopath, acupuncturist, conventional doctor, and founder of DrLandivar.com. In this channel, as a conventional doctor, treat my patients through natural medicine before recurring to the use of pharmaceutical drugs. So if you're new to my channel, consider subscribing and press that bell down below to see notifications and be the first one to watch a new video. If you need to learn and point quality supplements for your disease, visit DrLandivar.com and stay till the end of this video. I'm going to share extra tips and video links related to this topic. The thyroid is a small butterfly-shaped gland located in our throats, just behind the Adam's apple. Because it serves as the body's accelerator and decelerator, it continuously regulates things like temperatures, hunger levels, and energy expenditure. Thyroid problems can cause widespread symptoms of all sorts. And the worst part is that many times we get used to them. You have no idea how many millions, if not billions of people are suffering from thyroid problems and don't even know it. So in today's video, I'll reveal six symptoms that indicate your thyroid needs help and how to fix it before this precious gland ends up affecting your entire body. Number one, feeling tired all the time. And it's pretty common. Feeling tired all the time is one of the most common symptoms of hypothyroidism. You see this small but very powerful gland in the front of our neck produces thyroid hormones that control the energy production and balance in our entire system. For example, animals that hibernate during winter experience low thyroid activity during winter and keep them obviously sleeping all throughout that season. Thyroid hormones that have that effect in every single cell of our body can have that same effect on us. Now the opposite can happen, for example, if you find yourself with high levels of T3 or T4 hormones. You may feel nervous, jittery, and the complete opposite to someone who has low concentrations of thyroid production hormones. So now you know, if you feel tired and you don't know what you have, sleepy, lazy all the time, this could be a sign of hypothyroidism. Let me warn you that you might go to the doctor and that condition might not still show up in your analysis, in the lab results. This doesn't mean that your thyroid is not working at a low level, the low level it's working should be a lot more. And let me warn you that you might go to the doctor and lab results don't show a low thyroid function, but this doesn't mean that your thyroid is not working under what you really need. If you need a good formula for proper thyroid function, visit DrLandivar.com and check out Metathyroid from Finland, which contains more than 14 organic ingredients to help your thyroid function properly and stay healthy. Number two, feeling cold in your hands and feet. If you are sensitive to cold and you feel cold in your hands and feet, you might have a thyroid condition. The heat that is produced in your body is a byproduct of the burning of calories. And calories are burnt because your thyroid is telling your cells to do so. Now you see, thyroid hormones are the ones in charge of dictating how fast your metabolism should be working. In other words, they tell your cells how much fat they should be burning and how much heat they should be producing. This is why having low levels of thyroid hormones can cause you to be and feel colder, more colder than usual. And most of the times, sometimes you won't even perceive it. This is due to low thyroid function. Another common symptom I see often is how people with a thyroid condition usually have a lot more sensitivity to cold in general than the population, not only hands and feet. So luckily, this can be solved quite easily. Just take a supplement and stop eating the foods that will block your thyroid function. Something that contains iodine, for example, and stop eating breads, pasta, broccoli, Brussels sprouts, and other foods that are inflammatory foods that affect your thyroid. Number three, gaining weight or being unable to lose it. If you're slowly gaining weight over the past couple of years, or you're trying to lose it and you're unable to do so, it could be a thyroid problem or a thyroid hormone thyroid imbalance. Now, on the other hand, if I see hundreds of patients that might go on a diet and never be able to lose a single pound, also 
a sign of low thyroid function. Let's not forget that people who have low concentrations of thyroid hormones are usually moving less also, obviously because they're, they're, th they're sluggish. But apart from this, signaling their livers, muscles, and fat tissue to hold on to calories instead of burning them. This is obviously also due to a low thyroid metabolism. Very important not losing weight and gaining weight over the course of months or years. If you need something natural that can help you lose weight effectively that contains many natural ingredients, natural, very effective natural ingredients for this purpose, look for Figurizer, excellent, and Appleizer from Fineland at DrLandivar.com. Number four, aches in joints and muscles. People with a low or slow function in their thyroid are twice as likely to feel weaker than healthy individuals. Obviously, they don't have that metabolism in their muscles and they feel weak. And this is very common in patients who have thyroid problems, for to say, you know, so to speak. And this is true because I've seen how patients that suffer from arthritis also have low thyroid function in their, in their bodies. It's very effective to treat arthritis with something natural and at the same time help that thyroid function improve. Everything improves, the entire body improves, muscle weakness improves, pain improves, everything, every single thing in the body improves. So look for Kirk Health and Extra Flex from Fineland. That will help you a lot. If you need something for your thyroid specifically, you look for Appleizer or Metathyroid at DrLandivar.com. Number five, hair loss. Most people who suffer from hair loss for no apparent reason are usually the ones who have a thyroid condition. I guarantee that if you see hair coming, falling off from your, head, from your head continuously, slowly but surely, it might be due to low thyroid activity. And this is very important. Your hairs might quickly stop regenerating, resulting in hair loss that has no apparent reason. And this will typically improve when your thyroid issue is treated and obviously you get over it. Just to have an idea of how important this can be, I've seen how people correct their thyroid problem and see their hair stop falling. Some people might search for other potions and lotions of all sorts and never find a, something that can help them, obviously, because their thyroid is not helping their hair follicles grow hair anymore. They're falling off. So very, very important. Make sure that if your hair is falling, you take something for your thyroid and make sure that your thyroid is 100% effective all the time. If you need something natural and effective for your hair, skin, and nails that have everything, every single mineral, vitamin, and supplement you need for proper growth and regeneration, look for HSN Factors from Fineland at DrLandivar.com. Number six, difficulty remembering things and poor memory. I see patients all the time and I see, and one thing I see often is how patients tell me, doctor, I have no memory. I forget things. I can't even remember what I had to do when I crossed my house from one place to the other. Mental fogginess, trouble concentrating, remembering things. Let me tell you that this might be due to poor thyroid function. You see, thyroid hormones help every single cell in our brain also, and our nervous system play a specific role without deficiencies in any sort. Thyroid hormones are so important that when babies are born, Doctors have to check and see that iodine level in their in baby's blood to see if they will produce their hormone balance, hormone, hormone, thyroid hormones appropriately. If they don't have the enough iodine in their blood, a condition called cretinism develops where their brains cannot develop and obviously their memory will never function. So check and see if you have a thyroid condition. If you have poor memory, it could be due to poor thyroid function. And help out the channel by giving this thumbs up and share with your friends and family. If you have any questions, leave your comments down below and I'll be happy to assist you. If you need quality supplements for your disease or an online point of visual, I want to come and check out these other videos with these top and that might prevent a serious health condition in the future. Thanks for watching you guys and I'll see you soon.